Hello, and thanks for joining with us for this episode of Brass Reflections. It's great to have you with us. I'm always delighted to welcome guest contributors who have been members of our band over the years. And in this edition, it's lovely to be able to introduce Kevin, one of our former principal trombone players, to share his thoughts around a favourite piece of his. Constant trust from the pen of the masterful Eric Ball. Together with his wife Penny, Kevin now soldiers at Felix Doe Salvation Army, where he is the songster leader. Here he is just now, as he reminisces about his younger years as the son of Salvation Army officers. Hello, it's good to greet you in this way. Like many other people, I am a lifelong Salvationist and with officer parents was taken to the meetings from the earliest point in life and left in a pram in a side room at the hall during the meetings. My parents were appointed corps officers and moving around the country by the age of 14 I had been to nine different corps with them, thus effectively listening to nine different corps bands. Like many other Salvationists, I learned my music to play and sing within the Young People's Band and Sing Company, although have done neither very well. As a young person, I was taken to all meetings each Sunday, and when not involved with the Young People's Band or Singing Company, would probably not be too involved with what was going on. However, I do remember listening to band selections, which were usually played during the Sunday evening meetings and these soon started to have a real impact on my life. I don't consider that I am a brilliant musician, and whilst appreciating, don't always understand the bigger works that have been published for bands. However, the band selections that were played always contained some music which I could associate words of songs that we were singing at the time, and it was possibly more the word association that I was attracted to in this seemingly simple to understand format. Selections such as Light of the World, His Guardian Care, Guardian of Our Way are selections that were perhaps used on a regular basis with a real message in the words associated with the melodies contained within them. However, one selection that always seemed to stand out above the rest for me and still does is one written by Eric Ball and published in 1940, containing the following songs. When we walk with the Lord in the light of his word, what a glory he sheds on our way. The words go on to say, while we do his good will, he abides with us still, and with all who would trust and obey. Then the chorus, which is almost like an advertising tagline that says, and repeats throughout the song, Trust and obey, for there's no other way to be happy in Jesus but to trust and obey. This is followed by the words of song number 894 in the Salvation Army songbook, the words of which say, The cross that he gave may be heavy, but it ne'er outweighs his grace. The storm that I fear may surround me, but it ne'er excludes his face. Then the chorus reiterates these words, the cross that he gave is not greater than his grace. The storm cannot hide his blessed face. I am satisfied to know that with Jesus here below, I can conquer every foe. What a reassurance that is, that with Jesus we can conquer all of those things we find oppressing. Lastly, a song that is a good reminder for everybody that when we trust and obey and understand that with Jesus in our lives no storm can overcome us, even when our faith is small, trust in Jesus, that is all. These words contained within the song, simply trust in every day, trust in through a stormy way. Even when my faith is small, trust in Jesus, that is all. As I said earlier, I soon came to understand the love God has for me through his son Jesus, and from those early days of my life, I was introduced to this love that Jesus has for everybody. We only need to accept and trust that Jesus will guide our lives from beginning to end constantly. 
I hope you enjoy listening today as we share together with Eric Balls, Constant Trust. May God bless us all. Amen. Uh-huh.